Uh, how do I speed again? Left stick, right. I have to click it down. I remember things. Sometimes. It's also whatever that is. Can't see. Oh, it's- Oh, it's a- It's a thing! I want this. A fungus. Uh, breaking swipe. Please don't kill it. What'd I just say? Critical hit. Cool. It's a perfect shot. Anyway. Back on the trail. Here we go. It went so well for us last time. Do me a favor and go home already, will ya? No. I want to see the boss of the Navi Squad. Take me to Don Atticus. Like I said, kid, the boss told me to, uh, not to let any outsiders pass these gates. That includes you. I don't care. I'm not leaving till you, uh, till you let me talk to Don Atticus. Give me a break, you little doofus. The people over there seem to be arguing about something. What do you want to do? Uh, get a little closer. Hey guys, I'm here now. Don't mind me. Huh? Oh great, here comes another rando to ruin my day. I didn't think grunt work was w for Team Star, would newbies. Would be this much of a chore. Hold on, Mr. Grunt. I think this boy might be Jeremy. Wait, Jeremy? That kick who picked a fight with Team Star? Prepare to be raided. I knew it. Oh boy, this ain't good. Everybody else in the base is, is still asleep since we uh, were up all last night playing video games. Leave them to me, Mr. Grunt. I'll buy some time for you to go wake up the others. Why are you helping, little kid? I don't know. Yeah, and what's in it for you? Don Atticus will be in danger if no one's here to defend the base. I owe that man my life. Here, he's my dear compadre. And when crisis calls, one has no choice but to really rally to those dear to him, no matter the cost. Yeah, I have no idea what you're on about, kid. But thanks for the big assist. Also, I hear a gimmick. Alright, you villain. If you are after Don Atticus, be prepared to face my wrath. 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 I don't know. Uh, bring it on. Yeah! Pokemon, Pokemon Trainer Yusuf. Sent out Golpin. You know the rest. You know what I'm- you don't- you know. Uh, let's just, uh, Dragon Claw. I was very tempted to Rustalize, but I'm probably gonna need that. Gonna send out Shrudel. Keep current Pokemon. Guess I need to also set up the next few Pokemon in my team. I talk big, but I'm no warrior. Don Atticus, I'm sorry I failed you. Jeremy, are you alright? I was standing watch when I heard a ruckus all of a sudden. I got worried that maybe someone, something had happened to you over here. Ah, no fair, you had backup the, this whole time? Is this boy one of the Academy's students? He doesn't look like he's from Team Star. You're right, I'm not a member of Team Star, but Don Atticus is my compadre. I have to see him no matter what. Well, clearly you have your reasons for being here. Jeremy, I'd like uh, you to ask this boy some questions. You go ahead and get started on the base. Might I borrow you for a chat? My, uh, my man. Don't worry, I won't buy it. My man. Nice work dealing with the guard. 
Within that base lies Team Star's Poison Crew, the Na Navi Squad. Their boss, Atticus, designs the outfits for the team. You could say he has clever hands. The guys also are a bit, a bit of an eccentric. Oh, ugh. Start again. A bit of an eccentric. I think that's what they said. I can't read. You can never tell what he's going to do next. So, since it's beyond us to predict how he'll respond to our declaration of war, just take out as many of the squad's Pokemon as you can until Atticus shows his face. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready to kick off this phase of the operation. Time to wipe the Navi squad off the map. Well, first I have to do something very important. Let's grab this Gimme Ghoul. Now... This is an interesting setup. Should be alright with these three, probably. Let's go. Using the first three Pokemon in our party, let's go. Some guy, some kid locked out, beating one of our sister squads, and now he thinks he can take us on. Time to give him the boot, gang. Let's show this gate crasher what Team Star can do. And if you're listening, gate crasher, know this: unless you can beat 35 Pokemon in 10 minutes, our boss won't lift a finger to deal with the likes of you. Okay, 30 Pokemon. Let's go. Send Pokemon. Send more Pokemon. Send Pokemon. Sending all the Pokemon. Gonna fight the Moongus. Okay, what else is there? More stuff over here. It's a bit difficult to try and keep sending out Pokemon because they like to... Like, the, the thing on the side of the screen needs to be somewhat switched off. Before you can send out your next Pokemon. Okay, nice. I think that's pretty good. I might need to find a vending machine as well. If I can. Hopefully. Maybe? There's one over there. I'll check that out in a second. Oh, Varum actually fainted. Probably should have picked a better Pokemon. It's fine. So did I get all these? I think so. I'm glad that there's a timer for this. <laughs> it's gonna matter so much. Also, I don't think this is actually training Pokemon, so if you're sending out Pokemon, you probably don't need to send out a weaker one to try and level it up, because I don't think we're getting XP. No, we are. I can hear the XP. Maybe. I don't know. Anyway, I think we're done here, probably. All 32 Pokemon. Out of 30. He's way above our level. We gotta get the boss. Oh. This was- this is gonna go well. Boss of Team Star's Poison Crew, Atticus. Pray forgive my sudden entry. Tis I, Atticus. You're that scoundrel, Jeremy, I take it. You have some nerve bear bearing your fangs at Team Star. Come then, villainous wretch. A plunge into grim poison shall be your well-deserved fate. On guard. Here we go. What could possibly go wrong? It worked so well last time we were fighting one of these. I like that they all have their own Pokeball type thing. 
Naught but punishment awaits thee, wretch. A plague on your house. Okay. Well, let's start with Dragon Pulse, I guess. Venno Shock. Certain moves can poison with a mere Garret Graze. Tremble, scoundrel, for my Pokemon, for your Pokemon's sake. Oh boy, this is fine, probably. Crunch. It's not very effective. Skunk Tank's defense fell. Use Venno Shock. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, uh, hang on. Which one? Let me do Breaking Swipe if I can. There we go, critical hit. So I'm about to send that muck. Let's keep current Pokemon, I guess, for now. I probably should have switched Pokemon, but this is fine. Breaking Swipe. It's gonna lower its attack. Sludge Wave. Don't think we're gonna survive that. That's okay. I don't know what's effective. But I might also send out Whiskash. Maybe. Earthquake? I don't know if that's gonna work. Okay, it will, and it's super effective. Nice, good to know. Rev Rev Vroom. Let's keep battling. Uh, mud shot. Super effective. Well, this is going well. Here we go. You think to give me a taste of my own poison? Fie. I will fight until the uh, bat- it, yeah. Battle's end, I think. <laughs> okay. Earthquake. It's not very effective. Oh, so this is only level 32. Nice. Toxic Debris. Three. Cool. Well, I can't can't lose now, probably. So I don't have to worry about that. Very nice, just one more to go. I think the toxic debris means that if we change Pokemon we're gonna get poisoned immediately. But we've already won, basically, so that that went well. Very nice. It didn't take me half an hour to fight. With my last Pokemon. Forgive me, my friends. About a year and a half ago. Forgive me, it took a go uh, goodly time to pr procure the re required materials. Whoa, sick! These boots are insane! Ah yes, the fl move Flame Charge was my muse for those particular pieces. This outfit is everything I imagined it would be. Thank you so much. I merely wish to create a costume worthy of a great infernal airy. Of the great infernal airy. If it aligns with your vision, then I then I am correct. Content. Seems our outfit upgrades are all wrapped up then. Thanks a ton, Atticus. With you two looking like absolute beasts, anyone who crosses us will be sweating bullets. You're so good at these sorts of crafty things, Atticus. Those people bullying you cause you're you geek out over old fashioned stuff are out of their minds. The way of the ninja is rough, and fraught with thorns. I neither expect 
nor desire sympathy from the unrefined rabble. Oh, someone's getting fired up. Watch out, world. Our Atticus has fighting words. Yeah, don't listen to the haters, Atticus. I think you're really cool. Alright, gang. Let's move on to, our, to the next step. It's time to put our backs into our battle training. So we're all prepped for Operation Star. We gotta be stronger than everyone else in the team. That's what being a boss means. Indeed, it does. Henceforth, I will devote myself heart and soul to honing my battle skills. For the sake of the team, I would give my very heart and soul, but I cannot defy the rules. Our code must be obeyed. And so, this badge is mine to keep no more. I entrust it to thy care. Team Star's Poison Crew defeated. Take this contraption too. It contains a technique that allows one to cover their foes in gunk. TM-102 Gunk Shot. Jeremy is thy name, is it not? You have utterly bested me, but thy victory stirred no bitterness within me. Such was its brilliance. Don Atticus! Maicon and Padre! It seems this little fella has been dying to speak with you face to face. Don Atticus, please, hear what I have to say. I only need a moment. Whatever brought you all the way here? I came to help you. If you don't start going to class again, you'll be expelled from the academy, right? When the other kids at school and I were getting bullied real bad, you and the rest of Team Star saved us. Thanks to that operation you carried out, we were all able to go to school again. If you got expelled for being the good guys, that'd be the worst thing ever. Forgive me. Haven't you heard anything from the big boss? Nay, we've heard not a whisper since that fateful day. Without the big boss, Team Star cannot carry on. And without the team, the bright and merry student life we seek lies beyond our reach. We have no choice but to defend our bases till the big boss returns to us. You've evidently trusted this big boss of yours a great deal. Who exactly are they? In truth, not one of us has met them in the flesh. By their own word, they are a recluse. As with the rest of us, twould seem bullying was to blame. That's awful. Though their name and face be no unknown to us, they are no nonetheless our precious comrade. Our only choice is to maintain our... <laughs> our vigils from the bases, awaiting the day of their return. So that's why you don't go to school. But, but still, don't ever think that Team Star is all you have, Don Atticus. You've got a lifelong compadre in me. And don't you forget it. My compadre, I owe you a great debt. It seems we're one step closer to the truth behind Team Star's Troncy and the bullying at the Academy, but more importantly, I can't believe I had no idea about these issues the students are struggling with. They have friendships they hold dear and reasons for acting as they do. I just couldn't see it. It's shameful how oblivious I've been. Ha, huh. I believe Team Star to be the one and only treasure in my life. Methinks I have been mistaken. Mistaken. And there we go, that's two out of five complete. Two bases down, three to go. And they're only gonna get harder, I I would assume. Jeremy, it's me. I take it that Atticus's star badge is now in your possession. I see. Now that if its boss has been taken down, the Navi squad's days are numbered. Atticus. Sorry, I got distracted for a second there, again. Now, about your reward, I'll transfer, transfer some LP over to your phone, as promised. 
plus 6,000. We have 99,987 LP now. You can now make more kinds of TMs using the TM machine. Use those t new TMs to strengthen your Pokemon even further. I'll have my supply unit rep meet you shortly to deliver some bonus materials too. H hello it's me again, from the supply unit. Wha- what the heck? Hey, stop that! S- somebody help! Blah, it drooled all over me. What even is that Pokemon anyway? It's really awesome. Uh, I guess that's one word for it. Wait, is it really that special? Uh, um, before I forget, here's your reward. Lots of Pokemon materials. Um, your name's Jeremy, right? Since you're part of Operation Starfall's battle unit, can I ask you something? What do you think of Team Star? They're pretty strong. Interesting. You know, some of the rumors say Team Star w wasn't always a bunch of delinquents. Most of them used to be victims of bullying, or they just found it hard to interact with people. But then these misfits and outsiders found each other and, ba and banded together to form Team Star. All they wanted to do was push back against the bullies they couldn't face alone. But, uh... That's just info I got by hacking other students' social media accounts. I also found talk about some secret mastermind behind the five bosses. Someone who recruited them to the team star team in the first place. Hmm, I don't normally talk this much. Now my throat kinda hurts. So um, good luck with taking down the other bases and stuff. I'm on to you. And same with that Clive guy. I don't know if I trust- <laughs> don't know if I trust that Clive guy. He seems kind of sus. Anyway. Toxic Spikes TM. Nice. Grab that as well. And a Leaf Stone. That's also good. It's not that much left to actually explore in this area. In fact, I've basically explored this section of- this, this side of the river at the very least. Which is good. Please move around, thank you. Just want to check over uh, that way a little bit more, along this wall, basically. I'll challenge this. That was a lot faster than the previous one. I don't know why I was so short. Probably because I wasn't spending a long time on the boss. I feel like it's actually better when I struggled, struggled more. For some reason. the face in the background. It's just always funny to me. Also, I don't think we've caught this yet. Aracuda. Maybe we have. I don't know. Dragon Pulse. Well, actually, no. Breaking Swipe. I don't know. It doesn't really matter that much. Somebody's cheered us on. So we have better defense, I think, is what that is. Dragon Pulse. And there we go. Very nice. I don't know how you're supposed to fail one of these. Ah, uh, let's catch. Pokeball. Because I don't think I've caught one of these yet, so I'm just gonna catch it. I might have already caught one, but it doesn't matter, so. I wonder if you get materials for releasing Pokemon. Maybe that's why there's only eight boxes. Seems a bit weird though. Aracuda was caught. Very 
very nice. And now it's registered as a water type. Cool. I was right about it not being registered then. Okay, let's get this item from this corner. I don't know why the camera turned me around again, because it keeps doing that. I don't understand why. I don't understand. There's quite a few Pokemon around. I should probably be sending out a Pokemon to actually fight them. Probably. If I can open up my menu, please. Misty Terrain TM. Please fight. Don't just go back into my pocket. I think it just went back in my pocket again anyway. That's fine. There's also another Terra type Pokemon over that way. Whole bunch of Pokemon around here. It's also one of these that I still haven't caught yet. Not that one. Please, game, let me run faster. Thank you. Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? There it goes. Come back here. Can't escape. Okay, so let's. That's not what that was. Zerua. I guess that's a thing that can happen with some Pokemon, is they can actually hide as other Pokemon? I think it depends on the Pokemon though, but like this one can. And I think Ditto can as well, probably. So let's do. Sludge. I don't know, it's not, we're not that high a level compared to it, so that's good. Special defense fell, I think. Sludge again. Knock off. Sludge. Okay, let's try and catch it. Oh boy, we poisoned it. It's good and bad. Please don't die. Ha, 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 ha. It's very close. Let me... Great ball. Please catch, please catch, please catch, please catch, please catch one, two. No. Scary face. And it's gonna be hurt by poison, which is not good. I should have just ultra balled, but I Ah uh, I'm depressed now. That was such a good find, and now I've ruined it. By poisoning it. But I thought a great ball would be good enough because of how low how, how little health it had left. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. There's another thing here that I haven't caught yet. And it's not just going to randomly change form. Assurance. Clear smog. Doesn't affect for room. Sludge. Giga Drain. Not very effective. Good. But a crit critical hit nonetheless. And it's also healing itself. Headbutt? I think that's actually a bad, bad idea, isn't it? No, it's fine. Giga Drain. I might just have to start using Ultra Balls just to make sure I'm catching new Pokemon. Maybe. Depends on the Pokemon, possibly. I might... No, I'll just use Ultra Ball. I just keep missing catches for some reason. I've been struggling. I guess it also depends on the rarity of the Pokemon. So like, the other one I should have just used an Ultra Ball on because I can't just find one of those consistently. Where I could, I could find these consistently in this area, so. Grass Poison. I appreciate. I don't think I have Grass and I could actually swap some stuff around because I think... For room is steel poison. I guess I could keep that though. It really depends on a few other Pokemon, what their extra types are going to be, if they do have any. I didn't see what that was, that's fine. I was just mashing it back again and it's gone again. I don't know what just happened. It's fine. Everything's fine. Just, it's fine. I'm fine. Found an energy root. Absorb bulb. Boost the special attack, but I didn't see the rest. It's fine. Everything's fine. Probably. Big mushroom. Just a random item. To sell, I think. What colorful trees?
Do you know why these trees have so many colors on them? Uh, my face is up here. That's my answer to that question. Malak the student. It is a bit weird when you fight a trainer. Also, mimic you, that's cool. Uh, when you're riding your legendary, because whenever you drop off your legendary to fight, they just turn their head down. Gyroball? Gyroball? I think I'll just do it. Mimikyu is cool. Disguise? Was busted. Okay. Now, not now, Gyro Ball. I'm gonna keep changing between those two, and you're gonna be very annoyed at me. It's super effective. That's good to know. Shadow Sneak. That's a good sound. It reminds me a lot of uh, one of the sounds in Super Mario Sunshine on the beach. I think is what that sound is. Sound reminds me of. I need to play Super Mario Sunshine again. That's a good game. It's been too long. I mean, it's probably been like over a year or something, whatever. How I think that's how long it's been. But it's a good one. Wow! Now I'm all blue. My my Pokemon be zooming. I think that's pretty much everything in this area now. Basically. I'm just gonna grab this and probably go. Except that's uh, a thing, isn't it? Well, so there's, there's, uh, there's, never mind, there are more Pokemon here that I haven't caught yet. <gasps> Hello, my second chance. Uh, headbutt. Fake tears. My special defense harshly fell. That's okay. Headbutt again. Scary face. Okay, Ultra Ball time. We're, we're gonna catch it this time. Oh, well, so that means that the Pokemon I was just trying to catch wasn't the, actually here. The one that I was disguised as, but that's okay. That's probably why I was so confused by seeing it there, is because it was not supposed to be here. Which is because it's a Zerua. Dark type. Another Pokemon that I'm interested in raising up at some point. I'm interested in raising up a lot of Pokemon just to see what the different types are for them. If they get extra types, that is. Also, I'm guessing this is another Zerua because I can't imagine... No, it is. It is a belly bolt. I just want to see it blink. Hopefully I'm not going to blink at the same time, is it? Blink. I dare you. Headbutt. Blink. I want you to blink. Char ch changing power. Special defense rose. Headbutt. It blinked. How about that? You can't... You can't convince me that noses blink. Ah, uh, sludge? I don't know. It didn't take much damage from the previous attack, so I'm not sure what to do. This is not working very well. Headbutt. Because we're char charging it with power right now. By attacking it. So next time it uses a electric type move, I'm in trouble. Use charge. Powering itself up. Special defense rose. Good thing I'm just headbutting it. Maybe I should throw a Ultra Ball. It's gonna have a high chance and could work with the amount of health that it still has. Three and court, nice.
Very nice indeed. Electric type. Oh, that's probably an evolution of a tad bulb. Anyway, uh, I want to check the the things, the profile. Hang on, please profile. There we go. Still only seen one shiny, although I haven't actually seen it. But we have eight badges now, which is cool. But anyway, that's probably it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.